What's up, Six Dreamers? Welcome to Nitro Licks. Today's lesson is Drinking Problem by Midland. If you like the video, hit the like button. Leave a comment. I'm trying to grow my channel. I'll take any help I can get. If you like what I'm doing, hit the subscribe button. All right, let's grind out some Nashville Licks, y'all. Alright guys, let's work out the guitar parts and drinking problem. Begin with the intro, uh, fourth fret, third string. Hit it one time and then hit it again and slide up to the seventh fret. Ninth fret on the fourth string. That's the uh, open uh, first and second strings. then come down to uh, six on the third string and seven on the fourth string. Get those open first and second strings again. And then drop down again, four and six. Those open first and second strings again. So uh, the whole riff. fills during that verse. The first one is something like and that's just sliding up from fret 4 on the 4th string to fret 6 and then just uh, pick the 5th fret on the 2nd string. Let all that ring out. Okay, that's the first fill. Uh, and then uh, we've got one that goes That's just, it's kind of like a double stop on the second fret on the third and fourth strings, and then hammer on to the fourth fret and release. And then uh, a fourth fret on the uh, fourth string, and then pull off to the second fret and then back to the fourth fret. And then the next fill, and that's just uh, picking the second fret on the third string and sliding up to the fourth fret. And then I just use uh, my finger to reach up and grab the fourth fret on that first string. It ends up being an octave. And then that last fill of the first verse right before the chorus goes. And that's a uh, Six on the third string, five on the second string, and then uh, with your uh, on that second string, hammer on to the seventh fret. Uh, that's the uh, third string. Hit the second fret, slide up to the fourth fret. Second fret, slide up to the uh, fourth fret. Slide back down to the second fret, and then four, slide up to the sixth, and back to the four. So the whole uh, lick is, and that's all sliding, and you just pick it that first time, and then uh, slide and vibrato.
Sustain the notes. And then the chorus begins with it's just that chord there to the A and then play those notes first, second, third, and fourth strings. You're, uh, you're fretting the second fret on the third and fourth strings. And then back to the chord. And then we go to the riff that is the intro riff. Right, we just do that again. And then, uh, so the sixth string, the E string, open. Same thing with that uh, fifth string, open to second fret. That's my uh, ring fingers on the uh, third fret on the second string. Then I'm also uh, on the second fret on the third string. The rest is open. And then. And now we're at this chord. So four, six, six, five. And that lick is six twice, five twice, four twice on the third string. And then back to that chord. Second fret on the second string. So second fret open. Second fret on the third string, open E, open sixth string. And that is the chorus riff. <laughs> All right, and then coming out of the chorus the first time, we've got this little lead. It goes like this. And that is the third string, uh, second fret. And just uh, release to the first fret, back to the second fret. Hammer on back to that second fret. The next time around, uh, actually pick that second fret. And then that's just sliding up from the second fret to the fourth fret, and then back to the second fret on the fourth string. And then we have. Uh, This is a double stop on the uh, seventh fret, first and second strings. That's five, second string, four, first string. 
10, 9, 9 on the E string, first string. So. And you've got this little lick. So that's sliding from 5 to 7 on the second string to the 5 on the first string. Slide to the 5 and then the 4 on the first string. And then slide to the 5th fret on the second string and grab that 2nd fret on the first string. And then we play these same chords but we play them twice now. Two quick steps. that. And then the next lick is and that's before we go into the chorus again. So that is hammering on from the second fret to the fourth fret on the fifth string. Same thing on the fourth string. One to two on the third string. string the, the sixth string open and then back to the chorus right okay all right let's get to the solo All right, let's work out that awesome little solo that's coming out of the uh, that part. So we go. the 6th string, same thing on the 5th string, and then once you're on that 2nd fret, full step bend, release it, let go to open, back to 2nd fret and, and do that bend again. string grab that second fret on the third string and then here it's the fifth fret on the first and second strings and then a full step bend on the fourth fret on the third string and then release it Two to four, and then hammer on from four to six. And that's all on the third string. Vibrato. And then you're already there on that fourth fret, so we begin that intro riff again, which is where that begins. 
that fourth fret there on the third string. to the chorus riff. Okay, so that's the solo. That's one of my favorite modern country songs uh, and I thought it was a lot of fun showing you guys how to play it. Okay, until next time.